Inside Dubai's $100 billion sinking artificial islands Dubai, a city famous for turning impossible dreams into reality, spent over $100 billion to create its stunning artificial islands. These islands, including the famous Palm Jumeirah and the world, were meant to symbolize luxury and wealth, attracting celebrities, investors, and tourists alike. But beneath the surface of these iconic landmarks, something unexpected is happening. They are sinking. The very ground that these multi-million dollar properties sit on is slowly slipping into the sea, putting the future of Dubai's grandest project at serious risk. What was once hailed as one of the greatest engineering feats of modern times is now facing a troubling reality. Experts warn that the islands, built from millions of tons of sand and rock, are not holding up against natural forces. With rising sea levels and shifting sands, these architectural marvels are literally vanishing. But how did such an ambitious project go so wrong? And what does the future hold for Dubai's sinking islands? Stay tuned as we uncover the shocking truth behind this billion-dollar disaster. Vision Behind Dubai's Artificial Islands Dubai's artificial islands were conceived with a bold vision to reshape the city's future and elevate its status on the global stage. Initiated in the early 2000s, the project aimed to diversify Dubai's economy beyond its traditional oil wealth. Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, the ruler of Dubai, sought to transform the city into a premier global destination for luxury living, tourism, and high-end real estate. The idea was to create a series of stunning islands, like Palm Jumeirah, which began construction in 2001, and the World Islands, which started in 2003, expanding Dubai's coastline and providing exclusive properties and attractions. The islands were designed to be symbols of innovation and opulence, featuring luxurious resorts, upscale residences, and a range of world-class amenities. Palm Jumeirah, in particular, was envisioned as a man-made paradise, shaped like a palm tree, with its own private beaches and high-end hotels. The World Islands were planned as a collection of small islands forming a map of the world intended to offer unique and private retreats for the world's elite. Through these ambitious projects, Dubai aimed to captivate global attention, attract international investment, and establish itself as a city where the impossible becomes reality. Construction Challenges and Environmental Impact Building Dubai's artificial islands was a massive engineering feat that faced numerous challenges. Creating these islands involved moving millions of tons of sand and rock from the seabed and placing them in the ocean to form the island's foundations. Engineers had to construct large breakwaters to shield the islands from powerful ocean waves and currents. This complex process required precise planning and constant adjustments to ensure that the islands remained stable and did not shift or sink. The environmental impact of these projects was significant. Dredging the sea to gather sand disrupted marine ecosystems and damaged coral reefs, which are crucial for ocean health. The increased sediment in the water also affected the local marine life, leading to a decline in water quality. Additionally, the artificial islands changed natural ocean currents and increased erosion in nearby areas, which further harmed the surrounding environment. As the islands began to settle, the long-term environmental consequences became more evident. The disruption caused by the construction had lasting effects on marine habitats and local ecosystems. Despite efforts to address these issues, the balance between ambitious development and environmental protection remained a major concern. The challenges faced during construction highlighted the need for careful consideration of environmental impacts in large-scale projects. The sinking problem. Why are the islands sinking? Have you ever wondered why some of Dubai's artificial islands are slowly sinking? The sinking of these islands is a complex issue that has puzzled experts since the projects began. Despite the initial excitement and grandeur of these man-made marvels, the islands face significant challenges that threaten their stability and longevity. So what is causing these islands to sink, and why is it such a serious problem? The primary reason the islands are sinking is due to the way they were constructed. The foundations of the islands were built using sand and rock dredged from the sea. Unlike natural land, this man-made material is not as stable. Over time, the sand and sediment used to create the islands start to shift and compact causing the land to settle and sink. 
Additionally, the islands are built on soft seabed sediments that are not strong enough to support the massive weight of the structures above them. Another critical factor is the rising sea levels and changes in ocean currents caused by climate change. As global temperatures rise, sea levels increase, putting additional pressure on the islands. This added stress, combined with natural coastal erosion, accelerates the sinking process. Even though engineers have tried to stabilize the islands with extra rock and sand, these efforts are not always enough to counteract the combined effects of shifting sands and rising waters. The sinking issue is not just a technical challenge, but also a financial concern. As the islands settle, properties lose value and investors face losses. The once grand vision of these artificial islands as luxurious retreats is overshadowed by the ongoing struggle to maintain their stability. The situation serves as a reminder of the complexities and risks involved in ambitious engineering projects and highlights the need for careful planning and consideration of long-term environmental factors. Abandonment and financial fallout. As the sinking problem became more apparent, many of Dubai's artificial islands faced abandonment and significant financial issues. Construction challenges and environmental concerns made it difficult to maintain and develop these islands as originally planned. Some of the high-end resorts and luxury homes that were intended to attract wealthy buyers were left incomplete or unoccupied. This led to a decline in the value of properties and investments, causing financial losses for investors and developers. The financial fallout from these issues has been substantial. The cost of attempting to fix or stabilize the islands has been enormous, with billions of dollars spent on repair and maintenance. Many investors face losses as the islands fail to live up to their promises of luxury and exclusivity. The once promising projects have become symbols of financial risk and environmental challenges, highlighting the difficulties of managing such ambitious engineering ventures. Lessons learned and global impact. The challenges faced with Dubai's artificial islands have provided valuable lessons for future large-scale construction projects. One major takeaway is the importance of thorough environmental impact assessments before starting such ambitious ventures. The issues of sinking and environmental disruption underscore the need for engineers and planners to consider the long-term effects on both the land and surrounding ecosystems. This experience has highlighted the need for more sustainable practices and better planning to ensure that similar projects do not repeat the same mistakes. Globally, the problems with Dubai's artificial islands have sparked discussions about the feasibility and environmental consequences of building man-made land. Other countries and cities with similar ambitions are now more cautious and aware of the potential risks. The situation has encouraged a shift towards more sustainable and eco-friendly construction methods. By learning from Dubai's experience, future projects can avoid these pitfalls, aiming for developments that are both innovative and environmentally responsible. Dubai's $100 billion artificial islands were a symbol of ambition and innovation, but they have come with significant challenges. From environmental damage to sinking land and financial losses, the dream of creating a luxurious paradise on the sea has faced serious setbacks. As these islands continue to struggle, they offer important lessons about the limits of human engineering and the urgent need for sustainable development. While Dubai's islands remain impressive feats of design, they also remind us that not all dreams can defy nature's power. What are your thoughts on the future of Dubai's islands? Can technological advances solve these problems? Or is it time to focus more on sustainable practices? Share your opinions in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated on more fascinating stories and groundbreaking projects, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Thanks for watching.